Hey, I forgot to tell you. I got tickets to the Rangers Devils playoff tonight. Oh, I'm there. Manangalila. <laughs> what about you, George? Uh, 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 can't do it, can't do it, sir. I got a date. So, so. No, 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 no. If you must know, I I would rather be with her than, than go to the game. Ooh. <laughs> well, she must be a very special lady, huh, George? Yeah. Well, what do I do with the extra ticket? Oh, uh, hey. Can I bring Dave a putty? He's a big Devils fan. Sure, fine with me. Hey, by the way, if anybody wants an inside tour of the zoo, Sienna works there as a trainer. So she works at the zoo? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like uh, Diane Fossey, huh? You know, she's the only person that's ever been accepted into gorilla society. And you know, once those gorillas accept you, you got it made in the shade. <laughs> Hey, Jerry, you're a smart guy, right? No question about it. All right, you know I was supposed to go on a special tour today with uh, George's girlfriend? At the zoo? Yeah, yeah, but uh, before I met up with her, I stopped to look at the monkeys, when all of a sudden, I am hit in the face with a banana peel. <laughs> oh, I turn and look, and there is this monkey really laughing it up. <laughs> now, someone tells me that he did it. Well, I pick up the banana peel, and I wait for that monkey to turn around, and then I whack! <laughs> Let him have it. Kramer, you threw a banana peel at a monkey? <laughs> well, he started it! <laughs> it's a monkey, Kramer. Yeah, well, he pushed my buttons. I couldn't help it, Jerry. <laughs> well, I, I still think it's wrong. All right, all right, fine. You take the monkey's side. All right, go ahead. <laughs> I'm not taking anyone's yeah, side. Well, I know what happened, Jerry. <laughs> Oh, uh, Mr. Kramer. Yes. Thanks for coming. So, uh, what did you want to see me about? Well, Mr. Kramer, to get right to it, we're having a bit of a problem with Barry. <laughs> Barry? The chimpanzee. Oh. Well, uh, what's the problem? Well, he's not functioning the way he normally does. He seems depressed. He's lost his appetite. He's even curtailed his autoerotic activities. <laughs> and we think this is directly related to the altercation he had with you the other day. So? So what do you want me to do? Well, frankly, we'd like you to apologize. <laughs> yeah, well, he started it. <laughs> Mr. Kramer, he's an innocent primate. So am I. <laughs> I mean, what about my feelings? Don't my feelings count for anything? Oh, only the poor monkey's important. Everything has to be done for the monkey. <sighs> Look, I'm sorry. I, uh... Hey, uh, huh? th th that's okay. Um, well, I, I gotta go feed the marmoset. You know, George really likes you. I don't... Oh, uh, she doesn't hear too well out of her left ear. Oh. Hey. Hey. Well, I just spoke to your girlfriend. Girlfriend, yeah, right. Anyway, she asked me to apologize to Barry. Barry? The monkey. <laughs> well, uh, nothing doing. Jerry, I didn't do anything. It's the monkey that should be apologizing to me. Yeah. Well, I don't think that's going to happen. Well, well, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, I, uh, I just want to say that I'm sorry. I, uh, I lost my temper, and I probably shouldn't have. I took it out on you, and... Look, if I've caused you any problems as a result of my behavior, well, then, I'm sorry. I apologize. Even though you know, Barry, between me and you, we both know that you started it. I mean, who's kidding who? But they tell me that you're very upset, and God forbid I should disturb the very important monkey. I'm just hoping we can put this behind us. Let's just move on with our lives, okay? So no hard feelings? 